Hello everybody and welcome to It's a Love Thing. It's a Love Thing. Welcome back. We're back. <laughs> Again. Part two, y'all. I'm scared. I'm scared. <laughs> Part two. Before we get into it, please be sure to like, share, subscribe, and comment down below. We love to comment. We love to chat with you. And uh, we're praying and we're getting to it. Father God, we thank you for this moment of sharing. We ask that you bless this food, that it may be a nourishment for our bodies. In Jesus' name we pray, amen. Amen. Amen, amen. Listen, on our family channel, we did a collab with Chilling with Walt. And this is what he suggested. And B Love Life suggested it too. All day. This yeah, is spinach, fat hours. <laughs> this all both of them talked about. Chicago food. This is fat out, but you won't find it nowhere else. They're known for their Italian beefs. Mama Cinnamon got a, a regular Italian beef with hot peppers. I got a combination. Mm. Mm. Part two. Mm. <laughs> well, anyway. Part two, y'all. I'm going to take my time and enjoy this Italian beef in it and, and chill with walk. It better be good. They've been bragging about Southside food. We've been talking about this for a long time. So we did try. They both suggested the I-57 uh, ribs. Okay. That was amazing. So I don't pick, when I eat my Italian beefs, I pick at it. I never pick it up and eat some. I eat with my fingers. I don't know what to tell you. If y'all want to see me pick up my food, I really don't know what to tell you, but this is how I eat some. But it's sexy. Oh, it is? Mm -hmm. Oh, well, let me pick away then. <laughs> They suggested this one has been a long time coming, so we're glad okay. to give it a try. Won't be love, we'll see what it do. Mm-hmm, this is good. If you have not watched our Kool-Aid Padmon's Ball, that is part one to the story time. You don't want to watch this one without watching the first one. But actually, they would have to check out the chicken nacho video. I'm in the chicken nacho video. I'm sorry. Thank you. It's the chicken nacho video. Sorry. Yeah. So we spoke on how we met. Mm-hmm. That was the part one. What did we leave off? Um. When you gave me some sugar. Yeah. And you got right. out the car and I said I was going to marry you. Right. Yeah. Now. Pick enough from that as, as you heard. Mama Cinnamon just wanted me to be her fun bag. And that is so not true. Picking my up what we left off. Go ahead. Go my ahead. exact words, family. I said we're going to have some fun. Now, if you got anything, if you got something else out of the way, I'm just gonna be quiet. Mmm. You said friends. You said special friends. That's I didn't say friends for benefits. Nope, you said special I was friends. Thinking, but I didn't say it. <laughs> you said special friends. Well, so we're gonna fast forward just a tad bit. So after I get my sugar, I'm all excited. We finished talking. Now he's texting every I'm on, single day. Now I'm on something serious. In my mind, I'm like, you know what? She got away from me. Wait, why she she got away from me before? <laughs> I can't let her get away again. Oh. The chemistry was just amazing from the first conversation. It was. And is. people will sit up and say, when you know, you know, mm. I knew. So I'm coming hard. I'm not, I'm not trying to just hang out. I'm not just trying to be a friend. Mm -hmm. And y'all, to be honest with you, she had me in the friend zone. I did not have you in the friend zone. I was trying, I was trying so hard to date and court my wife. He was, she, he was courting me, y'all. She just kept me locked Poor up. Me. She kept me locked in the closet. She no. wouldn't let me take her out. <laughs> she wouldn't let me let take her out. <laughs> she wouldn't let me take her out. I'm like, that is not man, she, really, she really meant that for real. No, this is what I chose to do. No, I didn't allow him to take me out on any dates. She kept me in the house. I wanted to get she to know him. She kept me in the closet, y'all. I wanted to get to know him one on one. Without I, bumping into nobody. My food fell apart. I'm sorry. I had you what you doing. Where I dipped it. I didn't want to bump into a nobody. Because, like I said, I was fresh out of a relationship. And I just didn't, you know. 
I just wanted it to just, I want you to get to know me. I will come over. Man, I see this nice restaurant. No, we can order in and watch a movie. Now, over time. Oh, that's good. Over time, my light bulb started to come on like, now wait a minute. First couple times, okay. But we two, three months into it. And I gotta stay in the house. Oh. So I asked, are you are you hiding me from somebody? What are you doing? He asked me, was I seeing anybody? And I told him no. Right. I told him no, I was honest. <laughs> he was honest. I was honest. I was not seeing anybody. And it didn't feel that way, y'all. She wouldn't you know she how wouldn't let is. her brother take her nowhere. We couldn't go out to dinner, we couldn't go to the movies. No. We couldn't walk on the lakefront. I enjoyed you in the house. What's wrong with that? So anyway, <laughs> we just gonna totally ignore him. So anyway. <laughs> so anyway. Fun bag. Go ahead. Ooh, those fries are good too. So anyway, guys, we didn't go out on any day. Mm -hmm. For months. I'm not talking for just the first couple weeks. Three months. A little longer than that. Four months. months. Yeah. You kept it in that long? Yeah. Mm. Yeah, it was a little over three months. Okay, well, let me ask you this. So, did you enjoy being locked in the house for me? All right, then. <laughs> so, guys, <laughs> this is what happened. <laughs> we. <laughs> Nothing. I was just thinking about that. We really, really got a chance to really get to know each other. We was talking on the phone. I was working a full-time job and a part-time job. This is what happened. So we were staying in the house a lot for like four days. I was still living in my apartment. He was living in his house. And, you know, we were just getting to know each other all over again, which is nothing wrong with that. No. no. So... We started really, really feeling close with each other. Really close. Closer than what we ever thought. Mm-hmm. So. I'm going to tell y'all something. got to throw this in there. During this time, we're still catching up on old times. Mm-hmm. My wife pulled out her diary. Oh. My wife pulled out her diary from way back then. And when I tell you, your boy was in the diary, man. She was missing your boy. Yeah. So it wasn't just me. I was in the diary. My diary dates back. <laughs> I was in the diary. Not My only to still have it, but for us to be able to share that, come back together and share that moment. I was yeah. actually cleaning out my closet. I was your boy away. almost cried. I was throwing away a lot of clothes. And he was sitting on the couch and he was just talking. Hey, Key, I'm sorry. Can you give me a fork, please? So, guys, I was cleaning out my closet. And I was like, wow. You know, going through old stuff from high school and just all, just a lot of old stuff. And I seen my diary. And I haven't seen that diary in like 20 some years. And I'm reading the diary and I just, just look. Like, you're not going to believe this. So I show him. Pages and pages. I show him my diary. And How many can say that? And it came Can you pop? You don't cut me out. <laughs> I'm sorry. I was so, just getting excited about it. So that. I look out the window. It shows all when I, before I even met him. The guy with the curly hair. I really thought he had an S curl or something. <laughs> because at the time, Cinnamon was rocking a Jerry curl. Man, my pookie was looking like I ready for the, the world. I had the Michael Jackson yeah, curl man. going on. And I loved every bit of it. She messed up none of my collars, though. No. That was a good thing. Thank you. Hey, y'all. Get didn't out mess, of our video. She didn't mess up any of our collars, so that's a good thing. Yeah, this is so good. This is so good. I eat with my fingers all the time. Pops did before. But anyway, so I show him the part in a diary. You know, it even taught, it even, you know, how it had wrote down, how we had our first kiss and stuff. It was crazy. 
Well, I always, although I went on my life when we moved, I, I never forgot him. And that was the thing. So when we reconnected the way, you know, we were able to reconnect. I'm single. He's single. Why not get to know each other to see where it's going to go? Man, why not? So, now. <laughs> I think I was moving a little too fast for it. No, you were actually moving too slow. No, nah, well, that's now, relative. Let me tell y'all something. He that's moving, relative, depending on what moving, you're talking about. He was moving very slow, because I told him, I was like, look. If you, because he started out really, really fast, and then he slowed down. And once he slowed down, I told him, I was like, look. I wanted to be a gentleman. Oh, yeah, I don't know. <laughs> Be a gentleman. She was like one of the fellas, y'all. We switch roles. Oh, I'm, all, I'm, all, <laughs> I'm all sensitive and want to just, okay, you I'll hold you. Stuff, I'll like, hold you in color when she looked at me like, um, excuse me. <laughs> excuse me. I'm like, what? Oh, up? dang. Look fast, but. So, but anyway, but but to that point, though, that was exactly the point. My, I was on, I was on something just totally different. Mm-hmm. But bringing it into totally different. Bringing into uh the millennium woman, she wouldn't let me do nothing. Mm -hmm. I try to do whatever he What stories do you like? I like a lot of stories. <laughs> she wouldn't let me do nothing. What's one of your favorite restaurants? I love a lot of restaurants. Um so when we come over here. Well then, you, well then you, well then this just kept going on like this. I'm like, what is wrong? Mm -hmm. The chemistry is on point. We can have Ooh, serious conversation. Good. We can have serious conversation. We can laugh and joke. We love our, our uh, we have a lot of common interests. I mean, everything was there. And when I tell you it was perfect, it was perfect. Mm -hmm. But it was like she was keeping me like this. I'm steady bringing up marriage, and <laughs> she's steady I saying, know. "Oh, we gonna have some fun." No, why are you talking about marriage? What is talk? with you and this fun stuff? I'm just trying to hang out a little bit. Man, you can tell she had all brother. She, man, just like one of the fellas for real. I'm just trying to hang out a little bit. So after a while, fast forward a little bit, I started to break her down. I said, "You know, you grown, right? <laughs> and I'm grown, and for hopefully everybody." that's watching <laughs> is over the age of 18. But I you tell you, I that. have control issues. I never really realized how she much has control. control <laughs> she got major control issues. Yeah, major control. A lot of control. And I'll just leave it at that. She didn't know how to just relax and be in the moment. Uh -uh. She had to be in control. I was in the driver's seat. And, and we were, man, tussling. Man. <laughs> man. <laughs> I'm like, man, will you, you just- lay down. Will you just no, you lay down. No, you lay down. I'm not laying down. I'm not laying down. You lay down. Like, really? Yeah. It was bad. Oh. So, my <laughs> secret, that cinnamon and pops, we did not wait until we get got married for our first Night. Man, no. I had to test drive the vehicle before I bought it. Please, <laughs> me, I test drove the vehicle. He came, up, he came over here with some um Garrett's popcorn. I set that little popcorn down. What's up? Here go you. I was moving I a got, little. I got you some body wash. I was moving. I was moving, I was moving a little too slow for it. I got your own towel. I'm talking about marriage and trying to take it slow. I am like, you know, it's been a long time. <laughs> so now, now that just, it, it's not, <laughs> I'm stuttering. No stuttering. Talk about sealing the deal. So she thought I was moving fast before that. I was full steam ahead after. Oh yeah. I'm like, no, nah, I, I gotta lock no, this rock, one down. I rock this world, y'all. I gotta lock this one down. Mm-mm. No. Did I rock your world? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, you rocked everything I had. Yeah. But, <laughs> he's, he's talking about roses. Like, man, go with the roses and stuff. I'm doing that. I'm mad. The roses, the candy. She like, man, get go on somewhere with that sensitive I'm stuff. Go somewhere with that. Let's, 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 let's see she, how compatible we really are. Why she's talking.
to bring this to a close. While she's talking, while she's while she's talking all that mess, your boy broke her down. But too. did I shut you down first? You shut me down first. And you know, it yeah, was I was holding my elbows, rocking. <laughs> I was holding my elbows rocking. Because y'all family. Y'all family. So we gonna talk. We gonna talk. We gonna be honest. I was, holding, I was holding my elbows, man. I'm mad enough to admit it. Uh -huh. let's, let's tell them. Okay, so at that time, like I said, I had, was fresh out of a relationship. And so was he. He was fresh out of a relationship as well. So, my ex was just really... He, he just was really wanting to rekindle some things. And I, you know, I felt like we had stayed in that relationship as long as we possibly can. And it was time, you know, it was time to move on. So he was calling. And he was calling. Nine, stop. And he was calling and he was sending text messages. And now, he instead of, really now, instead of informing me that this is what's going on, we sitting just having a good old conversation. Her fault, she just got like 19 missed calls in five minutes. <laughs> <laughs> okay, your phone is ringing. I know I'm your friend, so, <laughs> but that, that seems kind of weird. So then you fast forward, we having one evening, we just having a good time, we're I laughing and joking, joking, watching a movie. She looking around like she don't hear nothing. <laughs> Um, you hear the door? She just talked past it. Like, I just asked you, did you hear the door? And you just sitting there like you don't hear nothing. I, you, 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 gotta, you can't just act like you don't hear the door. Somebody crying on the other side just saying, please just let me talk to you. He just wanted to talk. But wait a minute, hold on. And my line, what I said was, Man, it ain't that serious. I don't understand. Those were his exact words. He said, <coughs> it's not that serious. I said, oh, it's it's very serious. He was like, well, I just wouldn't. I, I just, if, I mean, if it's over, it's over. I would just be bad enough to let it go. And I was like, yeah, okay. All these years later, I can tell you it's serious. It's that serious. But anyway. <laughs> <laughs> that serious. Well, all right. Well, all right. Well, listen. Don't get it twisted. I wasn't the only one sitting here holding my elbows rocking. Because, so now you fast forward a little time, we're getting closer and closer. And I'm determined. She can tell you. We went dress shopping. I had not proposed yet. Okay, now, now, okay. He's letting it all we out went, of the bag. We Mind went dress you. shopping. Mind you, this man. I wouldn't call let it me, crazy. Let me tell you all about it. I wouldn't him. call it crazy. Let, let me just say this right here. She wasn't getting he, he, he woke up. He said, hey, what plans do you have today? I'm like, I really don't know. You know, I'm not really knowing what I have planned the next day. I said, nothing as far as I'm concerned. You want to go look at some white dresses? That's what I'm to do. <laughs> she thought I was straight I was like, nuts. What? He was like, you want to go look at some wedding dresses? You know somebody getting married. I mean, when we get married, why don't we? Well, it was strange. So now here it is. We go look at a couple of wedding dresses. I didn't like any other dresses. So he was like, well, you want to go look at some banquet halls? Man, why are we looking at banquet halls? You you haven't even proposed to me, so why would we do that? She had no ring or nothing. This man <coughs> has me sitting here in a banquet hall Picking out dates and everything, yep. and, and we're not even engaged. Yep. We getting pricing. We got a price sheet. We got all what was included. Okay, well, what I'll do, I'll put a thousand dollars down. I'm like, why would you, wait a minute, hold on. Why are you, why you, why are you giving them money? Okay, what we'll do, well, you know, if you guys want to, you can break this up in three payments. She okay, said, well, I'm going to put a thousand dollars down. Because all I did, I looked at do her, you think I, I said, I should put fifteen hundred dollars down. <laughs> I said, so I'm saying, looking at it, she was like, wow, when it does happen, this is the perfect spot. I said, this is the one? She said, yeah. I said, okay, well, how much I got to put down? No ring. I hadn't proposed enough. No ring. We had, 
We had a banquet hall picked out. We had colors picked out. I hadn't even yet proposed. This is a true story. <laughs> this is a true story. Well, let me tell you all something. He cried you. No. Stop calling me crazy. He is crazy. No. No. I was determined not to let you get away. Aww. I'm putting it on you that good that you want to marry me like that? I just, I just love you. I love you. But I wasn't the only one. You can't just blame me because I wasn't the only one holding my elbows rocking because, yeah, I put the deposit down, but you let me. You ain't stop me. Well, it was your money. <laughs> you didn't stop me. Guys, I'm telling you, it was crazy. It was really, really, but we were really, really excited to be back in each other's lives. And I, I feel like Yes, when anybody get married, you want to marry your best friend. I can talk to my husband about anything, anything, whatever I like, whatever I want to do. If he's not doing this enough, or if he, I need him to do more of that, he's willing to do whatever it is I want him to do. And you know, I love, I love you. I really do. I love you for being I think, the man that you are. Cause you are a good, I, you're a good guy. And I'll say this: what really, um, I think, takes. Uh, yeah friendship and relationship to the next level like neither, the neither one of us uh we look we don't love with limits mm -mm. Mm -mm. there's no there's no limit if i if i wake up at two o'clock in the morning and i want a, a full full meal i just she she'll get up and do it for me i will and same vice versa what there's no one no, i ain't gonna do that that's too much and it makes it easy it really do but we got that balance. Yeah, we don't. We there's there's no limit. So it it bring it takes our friendship and our relationship to a whole nother level when you can just be be free to be, be you free. and know that not only is it gonna mm. be reciprocated, but it won't be it won't be used. Sometimes, even in relationships, people can tend to hold back a little bit. Well, mm -hmm. I ain't gonna do that, or I'm gonna. I ain't gonna say I got this. I'm gonna put this to the side. We can, we both can, can give 100% of ourselves freely and don't have to worry about it coming back. Or it don't have to be. It won't be used or abused. Yeah. So put <laughs> to put an ending on part two. It was a crazy ride. She left your boy hanging. I thought I was gonna I thought I was gonna have to get a little crazy on her. Cause she just wasn't budging. She was trying to leave me in the friend zone, y'all. Normally that's the other way around. The woman be, oh, I don't wanna be married, and the man be like, man, we just gonna have some fun. That's how she did me. <laughs> that's how she did me. But man, when I tell you, literally, we had dress picked out paid for, banquet hall picked out paid for. And I still had not yet proposed, officially proposed. Yeah, I'm all in the dress shop. <laughs> ring the bell. She's ringing the bell ring with no ring. The bell with no ring. With no Is ring. this the dress? <laughs> but, 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 because of how patient she was, and, and I just wanted to make sure that I, I shopped, I took my time and, and found the exact one what i had in my mind what i wanted her by way of ring when i did propose it was off the chart the proposal it was off the chart the proposal wow it was off the chart what well, started out as a simple family just going out to eat yeah she thought we was going out to eat and we show up at, at this restaurant and there's a whole bunch of family and friends live band is playing they stop playing the music call up to the front stage call up to the front of the stage i walk up on the stage in front of all these people yeah she had the ugly cry i'm like this we should, i should put a clip in there but i ain't gonna do it like that <laughs> but she had the ugly cry y'all so so it was worth oh, it was crying too man i was balling he was crying i was balling Everybody. My cousins was crying. People, people that didn't even the band, the drummer was crying. Somebody thought that was sweet. You <laughs> playing the drums You're and wrong. crying. You wrong. <clears throat> Love is all right. We we are, and that's the thing. A lot of people, you know, when we got back together, um, a lot of people was like, you know, you know, y'all, 
it's a rebound for both of y'all, so y'all should be careful. I'm like, look, we going head in. And, mm -hmm. if, and if it's the biggest mistake that we make, then we'll just deal with it. But I married an awesome man. To, to that Good point. lover. <laughs> Woo! Yeah, we had some fun. Woo! Woo! <laughs> For the grown and sexy, good thing we ain't no family child. Oh, <laughs> but to her point, that's exactly what I said. And I, I told her this right before we found. Right before I told her we were gonna start going dress shopping. I told her that I'm going head first. If mm -hmm. if it fail or it don't work or you or you walk away, you <coughs> oh wow, excuse me. It won't be because. You didn't know how I feel. It wouldn't be because I didn't show you how I feel. And it wouldn't be from lack of me trying. Mm -hmm. And the rest is history. The rest <coughs> is history okay? Pepper went down the wrong way. You a pokey love. I'm choked up with love. <coughs> That's what love would do for you. Choke it choke you up. up. Oh, the pepper. Yeah, they choke you up. <laughs> I'm to you up. But guys, I'm telling you, um, and I know this video is going to be long, so if you all have to make this a part one and part two, hey, do what you got to do. But I'm not going to shorten how I feel about my husband. I married my best friend, my best, best <laughs> lover. He takes care of me. He yes, treats me like Lord. a queen. He treats me like a queen. Anything I want, he's gonna get it for me. We're just blessed. Blessed and really happy. Really, really, really happy. Really and a lot of people, I hear people say, well, all marriages have problems. I can't speak for y'all marriage. I don't know. I just know what go on with pops and cinnamon relationship. And we have and fun. A, and this is a love thing for real. It ain't yes. no this uh, way on the camera it's a really different. love thing it could have been a love it's a love thing we did a video back in the very beginning it's one of the co first couple videos and i addressed that of saying that you know people have literally asked like, y'all that happy yeah yeah y'all see how much skin glowing <laughs> yeah and mm -hmm. now she ain't knocked up either mm -mm, I'm just <laughs> mm -hmm. we just be smiling smiling but anyway we smile a lot when the kids be gone we just smile just smile when is quarantine gonna be over? Everybody else wondering when is quarantine gonna be over. We sitting rocking like it. It's all right. We well, don't want nobody to get hurt, but we good. Oh, good. <laughs> Look, y'all go on outdoors. Uh -huh. Yep. So guys, we're gonna come back. We're gonna do more couples videos. And we got a lot of stuff. We're gonna do the whisper challenge and the, the chapstick challenge. Oh, that's new to me, but let's mm -hmm. do it. We got we yeah. got a lot of a, a whole lot of story times to tell in a short time. Yeah. We've had some amazing times, yeah. some amazing yeah. memories we've built. <clears throat> so let me ask you this: We're grown, mm -hmm. okay? On Last the check. On a scale of one to ten. Mm -hmm. What? What would you rate me? What would I rate you? What overall? What? Overall. Overall. Yes. <clears throat> and ten being the highest. I'll give you some extra credit points to give you a twelve. Okay. And I'm not just saying that because it, she's my wife. So let me explain. <coughs> my wife checks all the boxes. Come on. She checks all the boxes. She's an excellent cook. She's a nurturer, like you wouldn't believe. She's very giving. She's very caring. God is first, second, third, fourth, and fifth. And I love that about him. And we can have fun. She's she's a she's like the life of the party all the time. There's there's nothing that I could look for that she won't do. If we if basketball is on, we can sit down and have a cold beer together and watch the game. And, and she knows what she's talking about. She's not just sitting there sharing that moment with me. Now, how many husbands can say that? Am I she checks all the. Ooh. Like chance to fry. It just got hot. <laughs> 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 we 
we got more to come, y'all. We're not going to make this one too long, but y'all get the gist of it. Thank you for joining us for part two. You know what? We'll do a Q&A, too. Mm -hmm. If anybody got any questions for us. So what questions would Drop you down in the comments. like to ask us before you ask me? I'm 25. <laughs> and I'm 26. Yes. <laughs> so email us those questions. Yep, however you want to do it, and uh, we'll be, you know, we'll, we'll be happy to share with you. It's, um, we need more of, of, of sharing real love and marriages and couples, and we, we need more of it. You know, it's, it's like, to me, it's like what's going on with this coronavirus thing. You hear so much of the negative side, but there's, there's hundreds of thousands of cases where they're, they're making it, and they're fine. And they're healthy and they don't already done, you know, back to their normal lives. Let's hear some positivity too. Yes. So that's what you'll find here. Um, you're going to find, honestly, you're going to find a fun, loving couple that enjoy being married. And enjoy each other, enjoy family, and just, just have a good time. Yeah. Have a good time. So until next time, as I said before, come on the journey with us. Please be sure to like, share, and subscribe. And comment down below any questions you got for us. Hey, Q and A, we'll be there. And don't forget to try Fat Alberts. Their food is good. I need to warm it up a little bit because we got the talking and stuff. But the, the Italian beef is the bomb. The, their fries are good. Yeah. Good customer service. Yeah. Um, it's outstanding. It's on. It's on the south side of Chicago. It's on 69th and Ashland. Um, if you blink, you'll miss it. It's one of those little places, but. I'm telling you, if you're ever around that way in town, make sure you try it out. Fat Albert's on 69th and yes. Ashley. They're known for their time beefs. Mm -hmm. uh, give, them, give them a try. But until next time, we love and blessings to you and your family. Whoa, whoa, whoa. We, 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 can't we got a hug, y'all. Come on, y'all. Come on in. Hug it out. <sighs> that always feels better. That always feels better. We'll catch you in the next video. Until then, we love you, and there ain't nothing you can do about it. Bye.